Welcome to video 130 in series 3, and now I'll write a script to set rotation. Okay, so I've finally decided that I do need an item set rotation script, and that's so that I can actually drop items correctly. So when I pick them up, if they're rolling like a barrel is rolling on the ground, when I pick it up, it'll be upright, and I can then drop it nicely. And it's really simple. So item set rotation. private item master item master public vector 3 item local rotation no need for update and I'll have here void set rotation on player if transform dot root dot compare tag so if it's on the player game manager references dot player tag transform dot local Euler angles that is equal to item local rotation okay and in set Russia initial references item master that is equal to get component item master. So in start, I need to set rotation on player. I need to call it there. And uh, in on enable, I use set initial references. So I'll establish the reference there. Then item master dot event object pickup plus equal set rotation on player. And just to quickly remind you, the reason why this is a set rotation on player as in the start method is because it takes a, a few moments for this game manager references stuff to get set up. So if I had called it an on enable, it would throw a null reference error. Well, good chance it would. Okay, so that's it. So it's a really simple script. Let's go to the barrel and attach it. Let me just start minimizing some stuff to make it a bit more tidy. So it's, it's all set up. Okay, and drop in item set rotation. Now, what is the rotation? So to find that out, just uh, drop the exploding barrel momentarily into the first person character. It's upright. This is how I want its rotation. And then have a look at it uh, here. Uh, so it looks like the local rotation is just simply 0, 0, 0. Okay, so let's undo that. Okay, it's back out. And that means I can just leave that item local rotation to 0, 0, 0. And it'll be fine. But that's how you would check with other game objects and just make sure uh, that it will be in the correct orientation. Okay, time to try it out. So pick it up. Okay, looks like it's fine. Let me try dropping it. Okay, it's on the ground rolling like that. Well, let me pick it up now. Let's see. Previously, it would be uh, it would be horizontal since it was dropped like that, and I just pick it up. Now let's have a look. Okay, good. So it's now straight. And basically, of course, it's with based off your camera. So if you look up and down, then of course it moves up and down. Uh, and that's uh, that, well, that's that. That makes sense. And uh, so now I can actually drop stuff uh, well, more appropriately. So if I have any skill at all, maybe I can uh, stack it. Probably not. Nope, no skill. <laughs> okay. Right, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.